Good morning everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, well, it's good morning if you're joining me in the morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, whenever you're watching this. You join me today with a poorly little puppy. He's been very sorry for himself, very grumpy this morning. So, you might have seen a couple of my charity shop book hauls. I've gone a little bit, well, I've been a bit naughty recently, I've bought a lot of books. So, I need to get reading. So I thought I would set myself the challenge of trying to read 30 books in 30 days. Now that sounded ridiculous for me, um, given that I'm doing my masters and stuff as well. But I've tried to do this over the last three or four days just to see if it was gonna be feasible and I'm quite confident that it is. Particularly some of the books, particularly like the Roald Dahl books are quite tiny. I just think a mixture, but I don't want to read just all small books either, but I'm quite confident that I can do this. So, we're going to give it a go. Let me know if you've tried anything like this before, um, and let me know as well if I should do sort of an update every 10 days maybe, or should I wait and do an update of what I've read at day 30, um, but I'm quite looking forward to doing this, so <clears throat> yeah. We're starting today, 30th of April, 30 books in 30 days. This is really good because on my impossible list, I set myself the challenge of reading 100 books in a year. And I'm about 35 off, and I've got until the 28th of June to get that read. So if I do this challenge, I actually stand a chance of completing that. So yeah, this is gonna be a win-win, I think. It's gonna lower the amount of books I've got in the house, it's going to lower my TBR and hopefully it'll help me achieve that point on my impossible list. So, I will speak to you soon, um, yeah, the, bring it on, bring on the reading, bye guys. <laughs> 